Hi Aries, welcome to your reading. If you are new here and don't want to miss a daily tarot readings, subscribe now by clicking the red button below this video. This is a general love reading, so it may or may not resonate with all of you. At the end of this video, if you are interested, I will also record an extended reading to know more specific details on their feelings and intentions for you at this moment. Okay, now let's start with your reading. First, let's shuffle the deck four times for you. One. Two more shuffles. And the last one. You have the World card and the Eight of Wands, the Five of Pentacles, the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse, the Knight of Wands, the Three of Wands, Three of Pentacles, Queen of Cups in the reverse, the High Priestess in the reverse, and the Wheel of Fortune in the reverse. The overall energy is the King of Cups in the reverse. So, it seems like... Uh, There's no such emotion in this connection anymore. Feelings of love are less than they were before. Now, at the current situation, I sense you will get... Uh, there will be a rapid change in the environment. I expect some communication coming your way. It will be fast. But it is with the idea to close the cycle. To end the cycle because it seems like the love is not there anymore but because of the lack of closure you are still connected to each other uh, energetically now what is affecting you in your subconscious is the idea that you felt rejected and left out in the cold unfortunately now in the recent past the connection may have been on and off also a very low chance for the connection to move forward something uh, stable so it seems like this person was not a committed type of person now you want to move forward this is your focus uh, to have some communication here with the knight of wands i sense you have a passion for this person i don't sense love Maybe you are attracted towards them, but you want some rapid changes, maybe some communication. And this is, again, uh, clarified by the Three of Pentacles, how you view the situation, where you are still interested on investing into this connection. This person with the Queen of Cups there in the reverse, I don't sense they feel love anymore. And uh, your hopes or fears with the High Priestess in the reverse. Maybe you have realized this person was not honest. And you want to avoid dealing with a dishonest person. So you are not sure now do they love you or not. But your idea is to avoid people that don't love you back. Now I want to clarify the Three of Wands, the Queen of Cups in the reverse and the Wheel of Fortune. In the reverse let's first clarify why the queen of cups in the reverse page of cups knight of wands in the reverse and the eight of cups in the reverse this person wants to come back they want to communicate with you but uh, again i don't sense they are very consistent here so don't uh, a problem uh, there's a challenge with consistency with this person Three of Wands, I sense you are waiting for an action from them. You are waiting for them to show emotion to you. Uh, you have been thinking quite a lot. And being guarded. You don't trust this person very easily now. But, but you are waiting, I see you waiting in the near future for them to take an action. And they will. They will uh, message you and they will turn back if they act upon this energy that it is here. Let's see why the Wheel of Fortune in the reverse. Seven of Wands. The World card. 
and the three of pentacles in the reverse at the bottom is the five of cups now what i see here uh, the idea is to come and message you just to to talk that uh, this to make that that discussion that uh, was not made before maybe the closure was not there uh, maybe you uh, parted from each other uh, not talking and not clarifying anything or expressing feelings and thoughts there's this idea from this person to come back and uh, message you i don't sense you are expecting them to come with their cup of love but i think this person is guarded they want to end the cycle i don't sense uh, a teamwork into this connection moving forward the best case scenario is to end the cycle and to start something completely new that's what i see here anyway i want to go deeper into this reading in the extended video that i'm just recording now where I will see the energies that are around the connection, around you and them. Also, how does your person feel now? How do they view you now? What are their intentions? And also an advice regarding a connection with this person. So if you are interested, you can follow me now in the extended video that is in the description box below. See you the next reading and bye for now.